What is going on, ladies and gents? Oh my goodness. Just got back from Idaho. I don't even know why I'm putting those on my head. Just got back from Idaho with the family. The wife's parents, they have some property up there. <clears throat> and every year we go up there and we just spend some good quality time, do a little bit of fishing, golfing. Uh, we watch movies, play some games. And then we actually went to St. St. Anthony and we went to the sandbar out there and they have a slide and diving board and I'm a little sore. I'm a little sore just from doing flippies and I'll show you guys right here. <laughs> Don't act like you're not impressed. But for real, I'm sore. I just went to Costa Vida, got myself some grub because I am starving and I'm too lazy to cook anything right at the moment. So Costa Vida it is. I'm gonna show you guys a little trick. I've blown some people's minds with this, but I'm gonna show you a little trick. So here you have your regular Costa Vida salad. I go with the house dressing. And what I do, spread it out there. That's how I do it, leave a little bit left. This is very important, leave a little bit left. Sorry if this is gross, but what I've done here, <laughs> I've ate all the lettuce, and now I'm going to curl this up into a burrito. And there you have it. You have black beans, rice, chicken, and that extra little ranch. Yeah, you just drizzle it across there. You're welcome. Seriously, I've blown people's minds with that. I don't know why, but that's just something I've always done. Ate the lettuce and then left everything for a burrito. First time I've done that. <laughs> I'm an idiot. But anywho, if you guys haven't noticed, this is gonna be a little vlog video of just kinda what I do to get ready for a trip, uh, especially a filming trip because I actually have the opportunity to go down with Disabled Outdoorsmen and we're doing a little shoot. It's a competition shoot between, uh, I think he said 15 to 16 guys and they all have different physical uh, disabilities and they're gonna be shooting bows, handguns, rifles, you name it, we're shooting it. They actually asked me to come down and film the whole experience and I'm very, very super excited I'm not just excited to meet all those gentlemen and be a part of this, but I also get to meet Angel and her family, Clayton and Brandy, Angel's mom and dad, and I get to just give them a big old bear hug because this will be actually the very first time I meet them, and I had the opportunity to do that video, An Angel Among Us, and I have I feel like I know those guys. I mean, I watched that footage so many times and so many hours behind that footage and I feel like I know them. I feel like they're just part of the family. And so I'm actually very excited to shake their hand, give them a bear hug and meet them for the first time. But I'm gonna turn this around and show you guys what I use to do all the filming. I don't even know what you call it. Just all my special filming. So for starters, we have the Canyon cooler right there. Got all the guys' stickers on there. I have some goodies for Angel and her family. My bag, tripods, toiletries, all that stuff. Brock told me I could bring a bow if I wanna bring any weapon to bring it. But I'm gonna bring the bow because I have total archery challenge coming up and I need to work on my longer, longer distances. And then right here is my camera gear. I have extra batteries. I have extra memory cards. I'm gonna try on the GoPro. I have all the cleaning supplies in there. I use this DJI Osmo Pocket for all my B-roll because the sound is not very good on that thing anymore. It actually doesn't really pick up at all. So that's all my B-roll on that camera. And of course I'll shoot B-roll on this, but right here we have the Sony Alpha, sorry. <laughs> we have the Sony Alpha A7 right there. And as you can see, the lens, sorry, I am struggling. That's the lens I use. And I like this lens. It kind of gives you a wider 
frame than my other lens that I actually have right here. This one is for more like interviews and all that stuff. But right here is my go-to that I have on right there. And I have the little road mic as well to block out all that wind. And yeah, just getting ready to go. And that's what's so awesome about this whole journey is the people that I get to meet and the things that I get to do, the experiences. This is, I mean, I'm doing stuff that I never thought I would do. And I have the opportunity to work with some awesome, awesome people and companies. And I'm just, I'm so excited. This is something I've never done. I've never gone out and filmed a, a competition shoot. So this is gonna be new to me. I'm going to make a video about that and I'm sure the disabled crew is going to take that and post it on their channel as well. Hopefully I can post it on mine. We're going to have to talk about it real quick, but I'm also just going to do this little vlog and kind of show you guys the setup and just go through tomorrow and just get little tits bits. Is that a saying? Little tidbit? Tidbits? Tits bits. <laughs> I am an idiot. So if you guys haven't noticed, I still suck in front of the camera. And or I just suck. I can't even say it without struggling. I suck at talking. And that's one thing that actually kept me from doing this for a while. I, I don't know why, but I, I get nervous sometimes in front of the camera. And then you just get to the point that you do it so much that you don't care. And you guys kind of get my personality. And for the new people, you're going to have to deal with this. This is, this, I'm slow. Yeah, I'm a struggle monster when it comes to talking and especially when I go into interviews or something important. <laughs> I get way nervous and I just, I uh, go complete idiot. So there you go, fun little fact. I suck at talking. I'm Wes, Rise and Shed, suck at talking, yeah. So. I'm done talking. <laughs> Let's, I'm gonna pack all this stuff up and we're gonna head, we're gonna go. Cause you guys don't wanna listen to this anymore. and we're getting everything all set up right now and then we're gonna go shoot some bows get those sided in because total archery challenge is coming upon us next weekend so we gotta be dialed in for that we got Mike and Brock over there playing with some firearms <laughs> we got this jumping jack all set up so everything's good everything is good <laughs> Get out to the range. We got the guys setting up some stuff, some plates, tabs, got the bow, got the crew. Getting ready to shoot. Excited because I know I'm gonna be a little rusty. <laughs> Sid, nice. 50 yard grouping, not the best, but we can get better. to the top and tighten it up. Not quite that far. Let's go down just a little bit. What do you got going on over here, bud? The secret family recipe, buddy. I like that. It <laughs> smells delicious. Homemade Italian sausage with peppers and onions, man. Oh, Until yeah. There we go. <laughs> that looks good. Oh, good morning, ladies and gents. Sorry I didn't film last night, but... I was too busy talking, enjoying myself, meeting everybody. <sighs> I didn't fall asleep until 2.30 in the morning last night. And I was taking pictures, getting those night shots. Oh, let there be light. 
Cammy Cuddy right now. Getting out, getting ready for the day. I'm struggling because I need two fingers to open. I mean, two hands to open that up. Just say, there we go. That's nice. It's going to be a beautiful day out there. Yep. I'm excited to get after it. Get up, get going. Need to open up my eyes though. Struggle bus is real. Let's do it. Here's a snack. Should have shade at every spot. So, drink lots of water. Yesterday it got pretty hot. So, start to release our time. Okay. Okay, are you ready? Okay, get your hand up here. No giggling when shooting. <laughs> Get hell. Hey, Angel. Angel, you, you gotta back. look back and say, uh, do we need to take a nap? <laughs> no. Do we need an angel nap? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Yell. Pull. Oh, baby. Yell. Pull. Ah! <laughs> hey. Got that one. Hey, right here. Right here. Way to go, girlfriend. That's two. Two. Some of the prizes. If you guys can tell, we have gold, silver, bronze. Some prizes everybody's going to get right here. Woo. I haven't seen it yet, bro. Dude, it is, it is amazing. Yeah? Oh, yeah. I haven't seen it yet. But this is Angel's family. They gifted me a little present, and I guess these guys got one too. I don't want to show it. All right, I'm, show I'm it. not even gonna look, but I'm excited. Left me a little message. I want to see this stuff. Here, I did a hell of a tape job. <laughs> it's beautiful. Oh my goodness. There it is. Oh my goodness. Oh, that is so bad. That is awesome. Holy cow. <laughs> Where are they at? Where'd they go? Where'd Clinton, or Clinton go? They went to go get some bracelets. Okay. Oh my goodness. That is so bad. We got the man, the myth, the legend on there too. That is awesome. That's not me. Dude, that is so cool. Oh, there we go. We got everybody right here. Where's Sid? There we go. Oh my goodness. How cool is that? Oh yeah, that's that's going somewhere special. Heck yeah, I gotta thank them. This is going in my red room. That's our uh, just little uh, angel among you right there, man. Oh yeah, dude, that is so cool. Oh my goodness. Yeah. That is the whole story. Yeah. Angel Among Us right there. That's that's so awesome. Oh yeah, I can have goosebumps. He gave me mine earlier. I was like, Oh my goodness. Oh. Miss Angel over here and her family. Her mom, Brandy, dad, Clayton, they make these paracord bracelets right here. And they were doing that to get Angel's truck chair. And then they had a family actually donate the chair because their son passed away. And Miss Angel named the chair Tyler after their son. And so these guys are out here hooking us up with some paracord bracelets. And I got mine right here. Angel, thank you very, very much for this bracelet. You're welcome. That's awesome. Do you make these all by yourself? No, me and my whole family. My whole family makes them actually. Oh, really? That's yes. awesome. They're they're super we, cool. I love we, the colors. Thank you. Well, not donated, but people bought these bracelets. So we could get more money for my truck chair. Gotcha. And then what did you name your truck chair? Tyler. Tyler. That's awesome. What color do you got on your paracord bracelet? Let's see that. And 
flag. That is pretty. That is awesome. Thank you very, very much. I appreciate it. We had an awesome event, guys. It was so cool to just see all those guys out there overcoming certain obstacles that they had with shooting. And some of those guys had never shot some of those weapons. And just to see them figure it out and get it done, like it hit right here. And I just, I don't think they realize, yeah, we put on a shoot and the competition and stuff, but I don't think all those guys realize what they did for us and the lessons that they taught us. Cause I know I left yesterday a better person and I have no excuses whatsoever. I'm fully capable. I have a body that works and I'm fully capable and I have zero excuses. And I'm just very thankful for the disabled outdoors guys and letting me be a part of this and film and went back to Mike's last night and had some whitetail steaks. And I tell you what, some of the best steaks I've ever had. It was so good. The, the man is just as genuine as they come and we, we enjoyed it. We stayed up for like three hours until like midnight 30, just talking and just having good conversation. So I'm just very thankful for Mike letting us stay over. And today we're out with Jake. We're at DJ Rams, just pulled up right now. We're getting everything all set up and we're gonna go take Jake on a Ram hunt. So I'm very excited to be here. I'm very thankful to be here and we're, we're gonna get it done. It's gonna be a good time. So I'll try to throw in some tidbits and whatnot, but you guys are just gonna have to wait till the film comes out. But hope you've been enjoying this vlog so far. It's been a lot of fun. Been having an amazing time. So keep going with this journey and we'll check back in later. You didn't even sign your cowhide purse.